three, two, one, zero. Ignition. Let's go. Falcon 9 rocket uh, with that Dragon capsule, Vehicle is uh, which is on its third trip to the International Space Center space station. Now, 2,270 kilograms of cargo on board, if you like the metric measurement. Got a bunch of things there, uh, 250 there experiments, uh, experiments on how to culture cells, uh, a 3D printer, which could uh, print 3D human tissues in space. Also an experiment about how microbes interact with rocks in zero gravity. That would have implications for mining in space. And of course, lab rats. I guess you can't have a mission to space without <laughs> lab rats, can you, Sherry? Yeah, very interesting experiments right there. And it's also going to be a historic moment when it comes to installing that docking adapter, which is what they're trying to do in the exterior of the International Space Station. That would be sort of a new parking spot for two future commercial spacecraft. Uh, this docking adapter was made by Boeing. Uh, that's what we're expecting from this trip. And of course, this would be the 18th commercial resupply mission for the ISS. And one of the final cargo missions that SpaceX will do under its resupply contract with NASA, Paul. So a very uh, interesting moment as we continue to see this race to space by not only Elon Musk's SpaceX, but also by other billionaires such as Jeff Bezos and Blue Origin. Yeah, so this is the uh, the 18th of uh, 20 contracted resupply flights that SpaceX has with NASA, but uh, a second contract has been signed. That'll keep uh, SpaceX and NASA's partnership going through to 2024. Now, that uh, next uh, set of missions will be using a new Dragon capsule, and that's going to be similar to the space capsules that uh, SpaceX has, which will be able to take crew. So uh, there we go, uh, now clear of the Earth, and uh, we'll wait for those stages to separate. And there you have it.